So I'm back with another food haul and you'll have to excuse the state of me today because if you haven't already guessed, I do look awful um, because I feel really, really poorly today but I thought I would try and film this anyway because it's not actually that hard to do. So yeah, it's a Tesco shop and it's quite a healthy one. Um, the main reason being is that I have been reading, just let me get them. Uh, these two books at the moment, so we've got Deliciously Ella and Eat Nourish Glow. Um, I'm really, really trying to like sort out my diet because the older I get, the more I realise that like I hate this phrase, but food is fuel. Um, and I'm just trying to like learn how to eat things better and lose weight. So if you're into like healthy stuff, then this haul might be a good one for you. But let me show you what I've got. So starting at this end, we've got some Asani uh, chapatis, we've got some quinoa and then a bulgur wheat and quinoa mix. So there's um, red and um, light quinoa in here. Um, I really, really like this mix. If you're like looking to get into quinoa but you want to like try it as you go, this is a really good option. Um, and I like bulgur wheat and it gives you a little bit more, you know, it bulks it up a little bit more. Um, so I've got those. I've got some uh, red split lentils because I'm going to make a curry at some point. I have three tins of coconut milk. Um, I have some whole wheat penne. Some uh, folded rice noodles, so these ones aren't cooked, so they're like still hard. Um, let me move my duster out of the way because you don't need to see that. Got some pork chipolatas and then it was two for five pounds, so I got these pancetta rashes as well because these are always handy to have in to like jazz up chicken or have them with pasta or something like that. Got whole roast chicken here because I'm going to roast this tomorrow and then have it in meals throughout the week for like lunches and stuff. Two packs of honey roast ham, two heads of broccoli, and a packet of sweet and cheesy strawberries. I have some Aspel uh, Classic Cider Vinegar. Uh, this stuff is apparently really, really good for your digestive system. I've seen it mentioned in both of those books that I've been reading, so I'm looking forward to trying that. I've got some vacuum pack beetroot. I have some uh, ripen at home avocados. Hi, Bill. I just got to my Okay then, um, I have some lettuce, uh, two of these, these are basically like angel delights, it just occurred to me when I was in the shop that William's never ever had these before, so I got a chocolate one and a strawberry one, I got two of his Thomas jellies because he loves them, I got a pack of six eggs, so I have another six in the fridge as well, but I like to have these in, eggs are a really great source of protein, um, I've got some intensely buttermint peppermint leaf uh, tea, um, I tried my friend's peppermint tea the other day and it was the first tea that I actually liked so this sounded really nice so I'm hoping that I like it. I have four bottles of soda water because you'll know by now that I love this with lime cordial to stop me from like snacking at night. I have two packs of olives so one's Kalamata um, and green olives with feta and the other ones are Hakadiki olives with slow roasted tomatoes. And then what else we got? We've got three um, cartons of this Alpro Coconut Original um, milk. Uh, it's like a rice milk, oh no, soy milk, sorry, um, mixed with coconut and it's amazing. It makes the creamiest porridge ever. Um, and I've been having that with plain porridge and frozen berries at work, which is what I've got here. So I've got some frozen blueberries and some mixed fruit. Uh, I've got these in our freezer at work at the moment and they're brilliant and it's just so much cheaper isn't it so let me show you what's on the other side so here i have some cherry tomatoes uh two packs of these easy peel what are they they're either clementines or satsumas but i got two of those don't tiger. okay don't forget tiger sorry about that <laughs> I got four uh, bulbs of garlic, I've got some basil and some coriander, some bananas, ginger, two limes, some mixed peppers, um, some on the vine tomatoes, six in there, and a cucumber, and I've got some carrots, four tins of chickpeas, probably going to make some hummus with these, or maybe put them in like a stew. Oh, you have to, excuse me. Um, tiger! You've got tiger? Okay, and I've got some uh, almond butter just to stock up. I have some uh, sun-dried tomatoes and then some roasted red peppers as well in here. I have um, some tahini, 
some olive oil, some flaked almonds here, and then I've also got some mustard seeds, some Albert Bartlett roasted potatoes, some chia seeds. I asked for the dark ones, but they sent me the light ones, so it's not, not bothered because they're no different. I'm um, putting these on top of porridge and things like that, and then I've also got some sweet potatoes as well. So while William goes to go and get zebra this time, um, I thought I would just tell you that was about £70 because uh, some of those things I was like stocking up on, some of them aren't the cheapest, like chia seeds are four quid for a pack, but they should last us a long time. <laughs> My little boy does make me laugh. Um, and yeah, I'm going to do the meal plan as always, uh, I'll put it in the down bar below and that will link to my blog and I will have everything listed there, um, along with any recipes that I might be using as well. But yes, uh, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!